So out of the whole kit, uh, I'd probably say that doing uh, these little antenna and the legs is probably the most difficult part. Um, they're in satin stitch again, but they're quite thin. So it means that your stitches need to be relatively small. Um, we're also not outlining them um, with a back stitch, which means that they need to be quite neat around the edges. Um, and this is just to kind of avoid you having rogue stitches um, and any of this black outline um, that's kind of where your stitch where your stitches go um showing so you need to make sure that's fully filled so uh, i'm going to show you how to stitch this uh we're going to do it in uh your black uh stranded cotton so 310 is your thread um you need to make sure that you've uh, split it down so you've got your two strands um you've threaded your needle and you've got a knot in the end of it um just so that it won't pull through the fabric so as we have with all the other shapes, we're going to start right in the middle. Um, and this is just to make sure that, you know, your angle uh, is going to be the same throughout. So we're going to start there in the middle. And we're going to go about there, I think, in terms of your angle. So back down the other side. And you're going to do exactly the same as you have on all the other things so you're just going to continue bringing your stitches up and down right next to each other until you filled the whole section so come up at the edge of the outline next to your previous stitch and down on the outline next to the end of your previous stitch And you're literally just going to carry on uh, doing that until you reach the bumblebee. Uh, and it's exactly the same for the antenna and for the legs. Uh, the legs kind of go in and out a bit more. So you can see how this is quite straight. Um, but the legs kind of have a little bit more shape to them. Um, and that's just through following the outline. Um, but the outline, again, is only a guide. It doesn't really matter if you... Um, make them slightly bumpier or slightly straighter uh, it's completely up to you so i'm just going to speed this little bit up a little so that you can uh see me kind of finish this section and then we'll come back and do the other half Okay, so you can see that we've now filled in all the way up to the head. So we need to come back to the centre and fill in um, up to the top of the antenna now. So we're going to do exactly the same, just in the other direction. So we're going to come up next to that very first stitch that we made. On the outline through and then we're going to go down right next to where that first stitch went down again on the outline and then we're just going to continue and keep going until we filled the shape right up to the end Okay, fantastic. I'm happy that I've now kind of reached the end of that section uh, and completed this section of antenna. So yeah, you can do exactly the same for all of the legs uh, on this bumblebee. Just keep going until you finish them all. <laughs> 